Given the incredible amounts of money that renowned gangster and bootlegger Al Capone must have made over the years, it stands to reason that some of those riches might well have been squirreled away somewhere. In fact, there are many legends of secret vaults containing huge amounts of cash, stolen artworks, gold bars, gemstones, and any number of other sought-after treasures. So, has anybody actually found them? Put simply, no. In 1986, during the renovation of the Lexington Hotel in Chicago, where Capone once resided, the property's new owners, Geraldo Riviera and his team, organized a much-anticipated live television special called The Mystery of Al Capone's Vaults. As millions of people watched, the wall of the vault was blown away using dynamite, revealing nothing. Not exactly nothing. Two empty whiskey bottles and an old sign along with huge amounts of dust and rubble. Not everybody had been expecting vast riches. To quote then Cook County Medical Examiner Dr. Robert Stein, who came along just in case any bodies were discovered in the rubble, I expect to find nothing uh, which we found. Nothing. This may well go down in history as one of the greatest televised anti-climaxes of all time.